What is the supreme law of the land? What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. The Constitution. What does the Constitution do? What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. Sets up the government. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. We the people. What is an amendment? What is an amendment? It's a change to the Constitution. It's a change to the Constitution. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. The Bill of Rights. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Speech. How many amendments does the Constitution have? How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. What did the Declaration of Independence do? What did the Declaration of Independence do? Said that the United States is free from Great Britain. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty, life, liberty. What is freedom of religion? What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life and Liberty. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What did the Declaration of Independence do? said that the United States is free. What is an amendment? It's a change to the Constitution. What does the Constitution do?
sets up the government. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty seven. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. What is the economic system in the United States? What is the economic system in the United States? It is a capitalist economy. It is a capitalist economy. What is the rule of law? What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Everyone must follow the law. Name one branch or part of the government. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress, Congress. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances? Checks and balances? Who is in charge of the executive branch? Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. Who makes federal laws? Who makes federal laws? Congress. Congress. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House. The Senate and House of Representatives. How many U.S. Senators are there? How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. One hundred. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. Six. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Again, answers will vary. Please go to Senate.gov to find your the names of your Senators. Every state, remember, has two Senators. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. 
who makes federal laws? Congress. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. 435. We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? Two, two. Name your U.S. representative. Name your U.S. representative. Okay, so again, answers will vary here depending where you live. Um, you need to go to house.gov and you can type in your address to find your specific representative. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All the people of the state. All the people of the state. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Because of the state's population. We elect a president for how many years? We elect a president for how many years? Four. Four. In what month do we vote for president? In what month do we vote for president? November. November. What is the name of the president of the United States now? What is the name of the president of the United States now? Joe Biden. Biden. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. Harris. If the President can no longer serve, who becomes President? If the President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Vice President. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four. 
435. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden. Biden. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? Two. We elect a president for how many years? Four. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? the vice president. Who does a U.S. senator represent? All people of the state. In what month do we vote for president? November. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. The Speaker of the House. Who is the Commander in Chief of the Military? Who is the Commander in Chief of the Military? The President. Who signs bills to become laws? Who signs bills to become laws? The President. The President. Who vetoes bills? Who vetoes bills? The President. What does the President's Cabinet do? What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. Advises the President. What are two cabinet level positions? What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education, Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. What does the judicial branch do? What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Reviews laws. What is the highest court in the United States? What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. The Supreme Court. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Nine. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military?
the president? Who vetoes bills? The president. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. Who signs bills to become laws? The President. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. John Roberts. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. To print money. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? To provide schooling and education. To provide schooling and education. Who is the governor of your state now? Again, answers will vary here. Please go to usa.gov slash state dash governor to find out who your governor is. What is the capital of your state? For this one, answers will vary. And the D.C. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. And residents of U.S. territory should name the capital of the territory. What are the two major political parties in the United States? What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Democratic and Republican. What is the political party of the president now? What is the political party of the president now. Democratic Party. Democratic Party. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? 
What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? That is Nancy Pelosi. Pelosi. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? To serve on a jury or to vote in a federal election. Name one right only for United States citizens. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Run for federal office. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Nancy Pelosi. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? To provide schooling and education. Name one right only for United States citizens. To vote in a federal election. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic Party. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? To vote in a federal election. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech. Freedom of religion. Freedom of speech. Freedom of religion. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen?
obey the laws of the United States. Obey the laws of the United States. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote, join a political party. Vote, join a political party. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? When is the last day you can send in, send in federal income tax forms? April 15th, April 15th. When must all men register for the Selective Service? When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18. What is one reason colonists came to America? What is one reason colonists came to America? For freedom. For freedom. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. American Indians. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans, Africans. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. When must all men register for the Selective Service. At age 18. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech. Freedom of religion. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. What is one reason colonists came to America? For freedom. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote and join a political party. 
Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. Why did the colonists fight the British? Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. Because of high taxes. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Jefferson. Thomas Jefferson. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4th, 1776. July 4th, 1776. There were 13 original states. Name three. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The Constitution was written. When was the Constitution written? When was the Constitution written? 1787. 1787. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. J. J. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? He was a U.S. diplomat. He was a U.S. diplomat. Who is the father of our country? Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Washington. Who was the first president? Who was the first president? Washington. George Washington. When was the Constitution written? Seventeen eighty seven. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1776. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? He was a U.S. diplomat. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. Who was the first president?
George Washington. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. Jefferson. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. John Jay. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. Louisiana. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. The Civil War. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. The Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Slavery. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did. Freed the slaves. Freed the slaves. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? It freed the slaves. It freed the slaves. What did Susan B. Anthony do? What did Susan B. Anthony do? Or she fought for civil rights. Or she fought for civil rights. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War II. World War II. Who was president during World War I? Who was president during World War I? Wilson. Woodrow Wilson. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Roosevelt. Franklin Roosevelt. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. 
What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. What did Susan B. Anthony do? She fought for civil rights. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War II. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Please name all three countries. Japan, Germany, and Italy. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. World War II. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Communism. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. The civil rights movement. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. He fought for civil rights. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States. Terrorists attacked the United States. Terrorists attacked the United States. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Crow? Crow? Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Name one of the two longest rivers 
in the United States. The Missouri River. The Missouri River. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? The Pacific Ocean. Pacific. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? The Atlantic, the Atlantic Ocean. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? The Pacific Ocean. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Pro. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? The Civil Rights Movement. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. the Missouri River. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? the Atlantic Ocean. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Name one U.S. territory. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Name one state that borders Canada. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. New York. Name one state that borders Mexico. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. California. What is the capital of the United States? What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. Where is the Statue of Liberty? Where is the Statue of Liberty? 
New York, New York. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Because there were 13 original colonies. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. Because there are 50 states. What is the name of the national anthem? What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. The Star Spangled Banner. When do we celebrate Independence Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. July 4th. Name two national U.S. holidays. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day. President's Day. New Year's Day. President's Day. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day. President's Day. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states.